gallery is a combination of my work, which are the portraits that are here, and my wife's work. She does the gourds and the baskets. And then we have about a dozen other artists, local artists in the gallery. The gallery's been around, this is our third year. And I had a studio here before that when I did portrait work and buildings and things like that. And all of the artists that are in the gallery are unique to the gallery. They're all local artists and you won't find them in any other galleries in town. And uh, we have some really good artists in this community. Good artists, good muse museums, and some good food too. So it's a great little town to come to and uh, we'd love to. but it's painted on. Mm, it's painted. Wow. Small dots. She also did that platter. Are real uh, flowers in there if you wanted to? Or move these around? Even these little flowers are interchangeable. That's super cool, literally. This was made by a local woman who's in her late 70s. And both of her parents were potters. And she learned how to do pottery mm -hmm. from her parents. And she makes the bowls and the wind chimes that are hanging here and the little tiles and these lawn sculptures. Completely different bird on it. Some have just an inscription like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, they're all hand painted. And I think uh, very reasonably priced. They're all triple glazed, a uh, triple fired. Their uh, holes are lead free. This is too. And those have some dog hair incorporated as well. Crazy, crocheted head. <laughs> and uh, this person does the glazed jewelry. And then I have a person that does those necklaces. Mm -hmm. yeah. Color turns. The giraffe has soft ears. <laughs> yeah. If you ever saw his vehicle in town, in his mid 70s, and uh, he has his own shop in town. Oh, you give me this, yes, this Don's Den. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, all these things are found object art. He just hangs on to things and finds a place to use them. And I really like this one. It's, it's called Spring Quail in Love, because it's got a spring, the head is a quail, and it's got the hearts for love. Wow. It's a very simple little piece.